okay, so let me just show you one more thing. Just a few more things in the back right here. Take a look at this back storage area. These struts over some time, usually they give out and everything like that. This is not bad for 190,000 miles. It's not falling and hitting my head. These, as I said, they're expensive to replace. Get any other manufacturer after nine years and 190,000 miles of opening and closing. These usually will fail. They're about $250 for the pair of them, plus insulation. You gotta pay somebody to install them. Essentially. But look at all the panels and everything like that. Just every, nothing is falling apart. You're gonna see when we drive this vehicle, you should hear squeaks and rattles from different areas of the vehicle, but nothing. No squeaks, no rattles. Everything held together very well. This has got this double decker storage, but Toyota's done a great job with this vehicle. Um, even, I'll say one more thing over here. Look through here. When you operate the seat, this is after years of operating up and down. Still locks into place. Seat belt retraction, just perfect. People just don't think. When you get a high mileage vehicle, they're mostly worried about the engine. It's, most vehicles, the engines will go a lot longer nowadays, but it's the small components, it's the little window switches, and everything, like I said, on a vehicle that tends to wear out over time. It's the leather, it's the ingress, which is getting in the vehicle, and the egress, which is getting out of the vehicle, which would really be a true show of the wear of a vehicle. This one right here, it hardly shows any wear to it. And it's got another 250, 300,000 miles of life. So if you ever find a Toyota 4Runner that's got high miles on it, don't be afraid. Look through this thing. If you don't feel good about it, have your mechanic look at it. But just, just doing the visual inspection that I did with you folks today, you'll see that this could be probably one of the best buys you can possibly ever get. Okay, so taking a 4Runner on the drive, just want to take it up on the interstate and show you guys just how well put together it's 2008 4 and our 189,000, call it 190,000 miles it has on it. As I mentioned earlier, everything just fits so tight on this vehicle, but we're gonna go on the interstate and listen. And really, when you drive something like this, you wanna carefully listen. Leave the radio off, put the AC so the fan is not, you know, it's not a high setting, so you don't hear a lot of volume of air, but I mean, accelerate the vehicle. Accelerates just as strong as the day this thing was new blowing past the Prius there. Doing 60 miles an hour and listen. No wind noise, I barely hear the road. Road noise, a lot of times you get road noise because you, a lot of tire places will try to upsell you or downsell you to help you save some money or something and they'll sell you the wrong tires. Wrong tires is gonna make a tremendous amount of difference as far, as far as your gas mileage, how it rides, and the road noise. I hate road noise because I spend probably about 5,000 miles a month. I drive about 1,250 miles a week in a vehicle. I put a lot of miles in my vehicle. So hearing road noise is the last thing I wanna hear. So no road noise, no lights are coming on. The vehicle's been properly aligned. The last time I got tires, that was about roughly, you know, it was over about 25,000 miles ago. It was the last time we had tires on this vehicle, but it just drives straight, it drives well. You can just take a look around on the inside. Big thing warning lights are on or nothing like that everything just operates properly people get worried it's got 190,000 miles on it what's wrong with it what's wrong with it nothing just maybe time to get something different but in this case there's absolutely nothing wrong with this vehicle you can upgrade your technology as far as the stereo components go but that's about the the biggest thing that would be a difference as far as safety and such goes it has all the proper airbags to keep somebody safe but its drive is most impressive. Totally tight, feels good to drive, no noises, there's no squeaks. We're going down a bumpy interstate. Take a look out there on the interstate. I mean, it's bumpy. This is like, boom, boom. Every transition, you can see the transitions coming up, and we're doing 65, and nothing, no shakes, no squeaks, no rattles. That's what I love about this. And this would be the right vehicle for anybody thinking and considering of buying a high miles vehicle buy a Toyota 4Runner, absolutely cannot go wrong. This is the true test. Anybody can cover anything when it's brand new. Brand new, everything looks fine brand new. This is really what a vehicle can do, is check it uh, nine years and 190,000 miles later because that's gonna be the true testament. That's gonna re be the true telltale of what quality, reliability, and dependability really is. That concludes our review of the 2008 Toyota 4Runner with 189,000 mile, nine year old vehicle. I hope you guys got a lot out of it. And always remember to thank somebody in uniform. 
from the Navy SEAL to mall security. We'll see you soon.